what is that in our yard? And it was 15 cows. Get in the backyard now. I would have been sitting wondering who rang my doorbell. Hey there, I'm Crystal with Ring. Up next in Neighborhood Stories, a couple of chickens try to fly the coop but couldn't get past their owner's ring cam. Get in the backyard now. Pamela wasn't going to let her chickens cross the road. She saw them on her spotlight cam heading for the street and told them to come on back. <laughs> Most of them listened, but not her yellow chicken named Big Bird. She's very old and she's not deaf. She can hear us perfectly fine. She's a little blind, so she really doesn't go with the flow of everybody else. You can say a couple of cows were in the mood for a midnight snack. The animals from a nearby farm broke some branches off the bushes and left a mess in Stacy's yard. She was asleep when they triggered her floodlight cam. It definitely takes the guessing out of it. I like that comfort of knowing, oh, I can just check what happened outside last night. Alona wasn't expecting any visitors when her video doorbell went off. She heard some rustling in the bushes, checked her recordings, and saw a wild and very nosy neighbor. I thought I got ding-dong ditched, but that would be a very clever person to run away that quickly. Then I saw the bear paw on my doorbell, so the, the bear did ding-dong ditch me. <laughs> Bears have super sniffers, and according to wildlife experts, they're attracted to more than just food. So it's a good idea to not leave anything scented like lotions or candles around your property. If you have videos you'd like to share with us, send them to stories at ring.com.